So in one of my credit card uh, bills came a little flyer and it said, you know, come on in and get your sample of, you know, because basically it's like a three day sample. And if I like it, I can buy one ounce of this stuff for like $75. But it really sounds like just what I need, extra firming, tightening lift, botanical serum. But I just can't figure out how this little thing is supposed to cover my whole entire butt. Are you a good witch or are you a bad witch? Or are you a bad witch disguised as a good witch? Are you more of the type to be consumed with resentment, greed, envy, jealousy? Or are you more of a loving, forgiving, compassionate energy? I don't think conscientious has anything to do with it. And let me tell you why. Right here in California right now, we have Proposition 8. If you vote for Proposition 8, you're voting to take away the rights of same-sex couples to get married. And yet the people that would probably want to push that through are your moral majority, Christian right, conscientious and it's so close-minded it's so narrow-minded it's so not thinking for themselves because they would realize that we don't really have the right to take their right away and what the argument on the television commercials for is it's going to be taught in the schools to your second grader we'll say don't think that if a boy doesn't have an inclination to be attracted to another boy, it's going to make him want to grow up to marry another boy. So are you a good witch or a bad witch?